Hey y'all, George Assad, and this is going to be quick, quick enough for a video, but long, too long for a short What If in Spider-Man 3. Well, actually, the Spider-Man 2 DLC, they take on Carnage, beat Kalidus Cassidy. That symbiote survives, and in Spider-Man 3, while you do have some missions where you take advice from Peter or aside missions where it's just Peter and not his Spider-Man ego that you control like Mary Jane or Miles' girlfriend. What if the event that brings Peter back out of retirement or semi-retirement full on as Spider-Man by halfway game is, as we can see here in this comic book, Miles Morales gets consumed by said carnage symbiote and becomes that game's spider carnage. And it's up to Peter to do for Miles what Miles did for Peter when he was possessed by the Venom symbiote. And then they go on and they take on the Green Goblin and what have you. And maybe even if the carnage symbiote tries a few fuses with the Green Goblin to become the Red Goblin near the end as well but that's just a few ideas I've had about this and I think that's a good way to go people saying they wanted to see Miles in a symbiote suit here we got one they wanted to see how crazy a spider carnage could be in the game here we can see it I think this would definitely be the way to go and show that Peter is not as wimpy as he they kind of nerfed him in two. Now they're going to bring him back and show him how strong he can be in part three. In a way, tomorrow we'll be Dragon Quest Builders. Wednesday's music. Thursday, Dragon Quest Builders. Friday, I'm not sure, but it'll be something short like this. Guys, take care of yourselves. Love you all. And have a good day.